Melang, welcome back to my channel. You guys, I go by the name of Sky Seha Bani Let us go to 200 subscribers. Let us go to 500 subscribers. I know I haven't been on YouTube in what three weeks, but uh, today is Friday the 22nd. I have an event that I've been invited to attend tomorrow. So today I kind of have like a little bit errands to run to prepare for the event. I'm also babysitting my little nephew. I'm not going to show you guys. <laughs> because, yeah, I signed up for the Because I signed up for this and th they didn't, you know? So, yeah, I'm just going to... Yo, guys, like, I have been wearing, you know, vests a lot, ne? And I be working out in the sun. And now, I'm too toned. I don't know how to get this fixed. It's so annoying. Mommy? Yeah. Oh, come here. Teacher? So, teacher? Yeah. Yeah. Yes, mom. Mom. So I need to get uh, uh I need to go get my shorts readjusted. <laughs> wait. Wait. I need to go get my shorts adjusted. Oh Mutim. I need to go get my shorts adjusted and then I need to go get my hair did and then what else do I need to go to? I need white socks also so we're gonna do that after i babysit though like my sister's gonna come back at 10 o'clock it's currently 8 21 so when she comes back i'm literally gonna rush off and then go to town and then do my things tomorrow we have to be at the event apparently like at 12 o'clock and i'll take you guys with so yeah if it's one thing about me guys i literally could not sleep last night so i decided to take my midnight data and download a couple of vlogs that i'm gonna like catch up on today i also just recently discovered this guy hey man i keep well okay i also just recently discovered this guy so i'm just gonna like watch his vlogs and then i'm gonna catch up on my fave jessica and then i'm gonna check Mandisa also because she uploaded well i already started on the vlog and then Tuto's vlog also with chaos so yeah let's get into it into close up shop close up office maybe like pack a bag for a summer vacation oh love that for you but if you're staying home like me and if you're planning on doing like things around the house which we're gonna do in this vlog because i don't want to leave everything for like the end you know like literally leave everything and then just work 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 mm -mm. and then end up not really like like the pants and this um silk blouse is kind of like this <laughs> Welcome to my channel, you guys. I go by the name of Sky Sehabani. For those of you that do not know, guys, we're taking Kiajahani because of I'm actually late. I have been invited to go to an event. So I'm late. Like it's 10 o'clock. I need to be ready by like in an hour. And I had planned to shoot a get ready with me, like a cute little get ready with me. But I don't think I'm going to be able to do all of these things now. But I'm going to try. So firstly, I need to iron my outfit. And then I need to quickly take a shower. And then I'm basically just done. I also want to eat something before I leave. Do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe, baby. Please. Um, by subscribing, by liking, by commenting, by engaging, by doing the most because we're seeing. So I'm just going to quickly iron my outfit and then get to the shower and then have something to your. 
December. So much to do and so little time. But written. Where oh? Friend, you see you're calling me and you're delaying me because I need to do stuff. so i just finished ironing as you guys saw so i'm gonna quickly go into the shower i think we can keep a regular timer because of Never serious, Kesana. On time, I think now I'm just gonna make something to eat and then after I eat, I'm gonna brush my teeth. I already did my face in the shower. I don't have time, guys. Hike in. And then I always go in with my also heavenly. One thing about me, <laughs> I will buy also heavenly, guys. It smells so good. Even in winter, I feel like it. It has I don't know what's in the formula, but something about it keeps you very warm and moist moisturized. You don't necessarily sweat, but like just that moisture, it keeps you warm. I feel like. So since I discovered that, I was like, you know what? This is my girlie. This is my girlie. 
kuze kuze. So I'm just gonna quickly, guys. I've been wearing vests a lot, and obviously when I walk in the sun, I get two toned. It's so crazy. Like, please tell me in the comments how I can get rid of this. But for now, I'm just gonna stand here. I wanna layer this boss perfume with my body spritzer. You know what? I always say. Go all in. Go all in. Because why not? So I decided to just spray a bit of this. Yo, any hey, just so that ke phatsi me bikinyana man ha tla gang ke phatsi me bikinyana and se se jenzi on abantu ba nara ntium And if you can, please go to the NBA Center and get the cash back because I'm running a bit late.
kgone go le monate but anyway guys um today is sunday i'm just gonna like chill and do nothing honestly i'm just gonna be home i got myself a bottle of wine so i'm just gonna have that and then sleep but before i do that Yo, guys, <clears throat> I need to vent. Now nah, I feel like I need to vent. I don't know if it's just me, but I don't think I'm enjoying December. I don't think I am enjoying this December, like genuinely. Besides the event, yeah, my bunny. I have just been home. I just have, I don't have less for anything. Marahu Boela Nete, guys, 2023. 2023. Zero out of ten. Actually, one out of ten. And that one is for the gift of life. Kisansi ki em. I just, but to be quite honest, guys, I just feel like this year was just too much. I was talking with somebody the other day and they like were asking me how my 2023 was and I genuinely said to them, you know what, I feel like I slept, walked through 2023. Like I was just floating through 2023. I cannot even, besides school and what else, nothing really happened. Nothing really, really happened and probably it, this was my season to sit things out i felt like i set 2023 out trust you me like i worked so hard for the things that i thought i needed at this point in life i worked so hard for things that i wanted to achieve i knocked on doors and nothing was happening <laughs> and now that we are here now that we are here in 2023 uh, now that we're here in december i feel like you know what maybe this was necessary maybe this me sitting out 2023 without nothing happening in my life like that maybe it was necessary because trust you me in the course of it all i saw who my friends were in the course of it all, I got to like know myself. I think as years go by, I think you can never stop stop growing. Even emotionally, mentally, you can never stop growing. So when you take a backseat in life, you start to see things for what they are. You start to see things for what they are. And I feel like 2023 was my year of realization. I found out, I realized this year was my year of finding out was my year of realizing <clears throat> i genuinely was in the back seat of my own life and i think it was necessary because i needed to see things for what they were i needed to see what um i really wanted and trust you me you guys i now it's december i don't even feel like going out i don't even feel like doing things i'm literally stressed because now i have anxiety i think i'm at a point in my life where i even i'm starting to doubt or i did actually now i'm cool i doubted my journey i would ask myself am i really supposed to be pursuing this content creation thing more especially with like TikTok and Instagram. Like, am I really supposed to be a content creator? I was doubting myself. I was at a point where I was like, oh my God. The emails that I've been sending, that I've been sending, people are getting back to me, but like nothing is happening. And like, 
I just like It breaks my heart a little when I think about it, but I'm I'm okay right now. Like I have made peace. I have done so much reflection that I feel like I'm okay with how this year went. However, now I'm like at a point where I'm like, I think I'm at a crossroads where I think I'm starting to, 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 to think I should decide whether I should continue or whether I should focus on something new or do something new or whether am I too in a hurry? Am I too like in a hurry for what I think I deserve? I, am I too in a hurry for... I'm good. I am so good. I'm good. I'm okay. Maybe man, maybe ki has taka. Maybe um it's not my time yet. I don't know, but this year definitely was like the worst year for me. Um however, I think moving forward like in 2024, I I want to do things differently. I know what I didn't do. I don't know what I have to do next. I know um more than anything even i think i need a, a stronger relationship with god i need to just get in sorry I for my I think for my sanity I think for just for my mental health and my sanity I am gonna take it easy on myself I think to be quite honest I am surrounded by people who are who are doing the most like people who are in the element people who are and I think I don't not that i am jealous um even if i was i think it's normal to experience such feelings however what you do with those feelings matters like if i am jealous and then i go do something dirty on that someone that's like really wrong but if i am jealous and like i acknowledge that i wish i was in a position that somebody else is and then i probably pray about it and then like do something about it i think that's better um i am surrounded by a lot of people who are doing the most like who are achieving things people who are doing like their second degrees people who are graduating people who are doing this that and the other people even in the creative space who are you know um getting brand deals people that i look up to who are doing so much I think I consumed so much of that content this year that I, it contributed to like the slight depression that I had. Um, and I think moving forward, I'm just going to stop doing that. You know, when you feel like you're growing and you still haven't figured out what you, what's, what's going on in your life. You still haven't figured out, you still are not in your element or if it's if it's anything that i wish for is like 
utmost peace. If it's anything that I wish for is like peace in a sense that I want to wake up and not feel like I have what well, I'm carrying like baggage. I want to be able to wake up. I want to be able to wake up and and not worry about anything like not even have worries or feel like this a heavy weight on my shoulders I want to wake up and be able to just go outside and appreciate the air and appreciate everything like i i think i'm so tired i was talking to somebody and i was telling them i am so tired of being on the chase i literally am so tired of constantly chasing you know i am constantly having to wake up and chase jobs or chase um you know campaigns or chase my content creation journey chase um content i am so tired like i literally just want to get to a point where i can just wake up be in my element do what um be in alignment be doing like what i'm passionate about and everything in my life going seamlessly i know it's like kind of unrealistic to want everything in your life to go right but life is better when you have a certain part of your life that's going right a huge part of your life that you prayed for that is going right um i think life is easier when you are in alignment with your passion like if you have studied law and you're doing your articles life is easier because you can you're in you are in that road to being an advocate or to being um a lawyer or whatever life is easier when you have studied to be a teacher and now you're doing your practicals and you are on your way to being you know a qualified teacher or a, you know what i mean like life is easier when you are in alignment and when you're doing what you love and what you're doing rewards you and you get rewards at the end of the day i think i am so tired of just like living in limbo like you don't know if you're like what's gonna happen tomorrow i think i want to be able to wake up in the morning and just be free be sure of I I I think more than I think more than anything I cannot wait to live in my prayers and to live um within what I'm destined for. I think that's one thing that I've just been so frustrated with in in in, in 2023 like I don't want to feel like how I felt this year. I was confused. I was, I felt out of place. There was a point where I had creatives block. There was a point where I just didn't even want to wake up and do what I was supposed to do. There was a point where I was really, really depressed and like I wasn't even talking to anybody about it. And I think like next year, I have understood the, I think this year I've understood the, 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 the importance, the importance of community, you know, um, we can't really raw dog life alone. Like that's not possible. I tried or I always have been like the person to go through things alone. Um, but I think I want to try and trust people more next year. I want to try and because if anybody, if it's one thing about me, ask anybody in my life, especially my close friends, they know if they need anybody to talk to i am there they know that if they need anybody to for advice i am there um 
and I'm not saying that I don't know that about them. It's just that I, I'm a very independent person in such a way that I never want to reach out to people. And I think I want to do that more next year. Um, so yeah, <laughs> I want to do that more next year. I think more than anything, really, I... I have understood the importance of community. I want to stop disappearing on people when I go through things. I want to be more present, like be a present friend and be a pre present partner, if that may be. Be a present brother to my sister. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. She a baddie, she knows she a 10. She a baddie with her baddie friend. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Um, this will probably be like my last vlog for the year. Until I see you guys next time. After this, I just want to rest. I just want to live um, within whatever I'm going through. I just want to reflect. I just want to rest. And then see you guys next year in 2024. I definitely have learned that consistency does bring you the key, especially to YouTube. Like on other social media platforms, I've been quite cons consistent, especially TikTok. Um, however, I think with across every social media platform, I definitely am going to be consistent next year. I think I want to take this time to just like figure myself out heal from whatever this year has done to me and just like um yeah so i'll see you guys next year i hope you guys have a lovely festive season ahead and i also hope you guys have a great new year yeah